Hello guys, welcome back to Keeping Up With Kamiko. Um, today I'm going to be doing a review on um, my first ring light I purchased by the company Newer. I got it from Amazon. Um, so I'm going to be unboxing. I took it out, I already took it out the big box that it came in from Amazon because it was huge. Trash pickup is tomorrow so I need to get it out. So anyway, let's get started in this video and welcome back to my subscribers i hope you guys are having a blessed day and um let's get into it okay okay as you can see it's coming in this box it's another box over here too it's got some more stuff um over here in this box i'm gonna grab it let me go ahead and grab that it's another little box of stuff I had opened it already uh, just to see what's all in here make sure I had all my um, make sure I had all my um, all the accessories to go to this so take this out This and this. this is the stand that it's gonna go on. Let me just put this aside. Is the the bag that is coming come in? Sit that on the bed. And so it came in. Nice little bag. Carry with you. Traveling, if you like. I wouldn't, because it's just too much of a hassle. I would uh, carry a smaller one, I think. Okay. Now, let's see what we, what else we got here. We have, we have the cord. We have two cords. As you can see, over here. We have the light covers. Or in each one, um, if it's the warm, I guess when you, if you want to have a sunlight slash warm look, you will use these. Yeah, look handy dandy uh, remote for camera. Another little, it's the phone phone holder. And instructions. So they have them in all all languages. This is in English. So let's get started, shall we? Let me get the stand up first, and then I can go from there. Okay. Alright. Alright. I watched some YouTube videos. <laughs> I, oh, my ring. Oh, wow. 
Where'd it go? Okay. Okay. So, we take this and we kind of bend it down. Pass it in. This is a... Um, Yeah. Oops. Got to tear it up already. Okay. Tear out like that. So let's see. Put it down like that. And so you have these three adjustables and then one down here. So, and this this will tighten up the legs, so you just screw that in. Screw that in tight so it won't go back up. Okay, and this is the eighteen. Uh, I got the eighteen inch uh ring light. Um, and then you just unscrew this and kind of lift it up. Pop it in. See? Lift this up. Unscrew this. And lock it in. It's pretty tall, guys. And, and I'm short, but I don't want it that tall. Unscrew that. Kind of go up from there. So you guys can see. It's pretty tall. So what I'm going to do is just bring it back down because I don't want it that high up. And then screw that in screw these in to tighten it then you're gonna take let's plug this and go ahead and plug the uh plug this in let's see we got two ports okay and you're gonna take this cord here plug it into this right here Then you're gonna this right here will plug into the light this in right here I'm gonna plug it in real quick okay got that plugged in and then let's uh Plug this ring light in. Let's see. Oops. Take it like this. And you're gonna just gonna twist in. You're gonna take it and then twist it in. And then right here you have your your um your uh the power right here and you can adjust the lights how you want it Let's see. See, right. Wait a minute. it's really pretty let me show you guys this is low just let me turn my camera around so I'm facing so you guys can see Really bright. Sorry for the light. Then I'm gonna turn it up real high. It's gonna be super bright. See how bright that light is? I love it. And then we dim it down, whatever your preference is. Like so. Yeah. This is the high as it go. I'm gonna turn it back down. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this and put it in it 
down here. I'm gonna get that on top there. Yeah. And then we're gonna screw wait a minute. Let me turn it guys so you guys can see. We're gonna screw this side in. And then I'm gonna screw this side in, lock that in too. So let's stay. Let's stay put. So it won't go down. And actually, guys, I'm gonna bring it down a little bit lower because it's kind of high. So I'm gonna bring it all the way down. I'll just keep it like that. I'm gonna bring this one down. I'm gonna bring this one down. trying to show you this end right here it'll go to this end right here so it's already just slide it up under there and then take this side This one at the top. I guess I go in this way. Break it down a little bit. Slide it down. I don't know why this part is uh, still stuck out a little bit. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to make sure I got it in there. Okay. Why is it? Let me see. it and I want to show you guys uh, my, my cell phone but I am recording on my phone so I'll show you guys uh, the light I'll put my phone right here and then come back I'm still not liking this it's still not why is it not it's like it's still a little funky right here give me a second guys while i fix this <laughs> okay guys i got it together so that's what it looked like i'm gonna turn it on with the uh, covers on there now so you guys can see Again, it's gonna get bright. So I apologize about the lights. <laughs> get over here. Let's see. Bring it down. 
You guys probably couldn't see it. Sorry. Yeah. Anywho. That's that. And I guess I could do do a comparison hold on okay so this is me without no lighting let me turn my uh vanity light off so you guys can really see okay this is just the natural lighting um coming in from my window and um so i'm gonna turn this ring light on so you guys can see how bright it gets It. Turn it over here. Then I'm adjust it. This is at its brightest. If you're looking at me, you can see. Okay, this is at its brightest. And then I'm gonna turn it down. Like in between me. I'm just gonna go slowly so you guys can see. And that's really, really low. And then it's completely off. So you, can you tell the difference? Whew, they're like blinding me. <laughs> but yeah, guys. Great investment. I needed it. Because sometimes I don't want to turn on. I have to turn on all the lights in my kitchen. To get the light that I'm, the lighting I'm looking for. And, um. That's that. And then you have your remote. And that's if you, you know, take a picture for it. You know, if you want to, you know, to take a picture. And it works perfectly fine. Yeah. So I'm just trying to open this thing up here. And all you do is just um, connect it to your Bluetooth. And uh, you'll be able to take uh, photos from your phone sit, sit, sitting right here. Okay. So that is the review of the newer, newer light. Again, this is not a sponsored video. Um, I, uh, regular price, this was $89. Um, the price is fluctuated on on Amazon talk to you guys the the price is uh fluctuated um um on Amazon it went up from like ninety eight dollars a hundred and nine dollars hundred and six so on but then it went down to eighty nine that's when I purchased it and then because I used um I'm with Amazon Prime so I used uh what was it a ten percent coupon on there or something like that or 15 percent something like that and um well, that's when i got it but last time i was gonna get it, it had jumped back up to like 100 and i was like i ain't gonna get that but um <laughs> i waited to you know it dropped back down again then i used my little it give you a 10 percent discount i want to say 10 or 15 percent so i went on and purchased it so yeah it was like 89 dollars so you guys looking for a ring light to need one invest in this no, they got different types. They got all kind of different type of lighting. Um, so, you know, whichever one you prefer, you know, go ahead and get it. You know, you won't regret it. I'm surely not. <laughs> so, I, I hope you enjoyed this little review. Like I said, this is my first ring light. Um, so, I'm excited to use it while I'm cooking dinner tonight. And, um hope you guys noticed the different uh, the different but it did my box did my box was a little damaged let me show you guys it came in a big box it came in a big box but I noticed it was a damage 
done to the box right here. It was already inside another box and right here. So something heavy had hit it, had to hit it, or it probably was piled up on some more boxes in the truck or whatever that were heavy and made those dents. Because I did see a little. You guys, can you guys see that? Um, this right here, this little mark. I don't know if you guys can see it. See it. Um, where is that? Come on. Focus. Um, but it's right. Where my finger at? Oh, the going down with it. So it's right here. You see that little scuffle right there? So that's probably where whatever it was um, fell on it or something to make that little scratch on it. But other, other than that, hey, it's okay. It's all right with me, baby. It's all right. But, you know, I'm just glad it didn't damage it even, even more, you know. So that's nothing. You can't even see it, you know. You won't even notice it when the light is on. So, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this review. And until next time, um, thanks for watching. And if you have not subscribed, please do so. Um, come join your girl. Keep it up with Kamiko. I would love to have you all. Um, and remember, God loves you. So do I. And it's not a thing you can do about it. Okay? Smooches. Sorry, guys. I thought I was finished. But I had a package to come in. I forgot I had, um, went to Sephora and I needed some setting, um, spray and, um, this lip liner, um, that I had got. But they didn't have it in stock in the store, so they had to ship it to my house. So, it's the box. I'll share what you got with I wish it would have came when I did my what's in my Sephora bag. Uh, video. You haven't watched it. Go so check me out. I'll check the girl out. So, I usually use the Urban Decay um up all night up all nighter um but this one was new to me um this is a pollution protection environmental defense makeup setting spray and this is um it says make your makeup last up to 16 hours and help protect against oxidation due to pollution all nighter pollution protection miss on um, weightlessly to keep makeup looking just just applied infused with the blend of minerals including zinc, magnesium, and copper. Our light as air formula acts like a protective barrier throughout the day to guard skin against whatever the day throws at you for all skin types. So, and it says, in a clinical study of all night of pollution protection makeup setting spray, 90% of participants um, said their makeup stayed on for 16 hour. 90% said the, the product kept their makeup looking freshly applied. 96% said the formula was lightweight and breathable. 90% said the product didn't settle, didn't settle into fine lines after 16 hour. So when I saw this, I had to pick this up and then you can just see what it says on the back. So I had to order this and this was, um, uh, 32 or 36 dollars I believe so I got I ran out of the other one I use and let me tell you something it stays on your face it's it's worth it I'm telling you your makeup stay put you hear me it stay put baby and then I got the um, Kat Von D uh, lip liner and crucifix like um, for a lip liner I had to get that and this was um this was $19 for that. I remember the price on that one. So, um, it's really good. I cannot wait to plan me some makeup and all that judge, you know, and show you guys, um, my makeup 
front of it. Sometimes I do heavy, not too heavy, because I don't put all that eyeshadow and stuff on. Sometimes I just, I'm just basic. But, um, that's what it looks like. Let me swatch it for you guys. Let me see. Bring it down. Let's do it. Let's do this. Hold on. Let's watch it. So it's really, it's a really good brown. Let's see, can you see that? There we go. That's what it looked like on. So, I like it. I needed a brown lippy. So, um, yeah. That is my uh, little product uh, review that I was waiting on. Um, and maybe I'll share with you guys um, a light, a light makeup. I'm no professional. I just do what I do for what I've been watching over the years from YouTube videos and stuff like that. And um, yeah, maybe I'll share with you guys um, how I do my face, my eyebrows and all that stuff. Um, I do want to get some um the magnetic eyeliner eyeliner for my lashes and stuff, but I use um duo in the sensitive. It's really good because it goes on white but dries up clear. So that's a really good lash glue for people with sensitive skin like myself. So check that out. I'm gonna try to link these below, but if you don't see it, you know, yeah, girl, still learning, okay. Okay. I tried to do it the other day, but it didn't it didn't it didn't go like planned. But working on it, guys. I'm still new to this, but I enjoy doing this. Like, my little hobby, you know. Um, and, you know, it's like, you know, hopefully one day it could be some source of, um, you know, whatever. Income, whatever, you know. But anyway, but I just wanted to share with you guys about this. This right here, I cannot wait to use it because I want to see what it's about. When I do my makeup, I'm going to do it. And then I'm going to wear it for 16 hours and see what this does. So, closing out this video. <laughs> Bye, guys. Until next time. Thanks for watching. Smooching. Again.